They're the world's smallest and arguably most adorable pachyderms. But it seems being cute won't protect Saba's pygmy elephants from poachers. A tragic discovery has revealed that 10 endangered pygmy elephants, seven females and three males, believed to be from the same family, have been killed in the past three weeks. But early speculation suggests the elephants died after eating something poisonous, perhaps left by plantation workers to stop wild animals from eating their crops. Wildlife authorities in Malaysian Borneo say they recently found two pygmy elephants believed to be killed illegally for their tusks. One of them was a beloved elephant named Saber who got his nickname from his slanted tusks. He had been rescued from a plantation and translocated in October. Authorities found his bones on December 31st and believe he was killed in November. Just a day or so before, they came upon another elephant recently slaughtered with his face cut off. This three-month-old baby elephant was found standing just by its mother, desperately trying to wake her up. This three-month-old pygmy elephant named Joe is getting some attention from a caretaker who, for now, is his only family. It's a troubling trend. As The Guardian notes, elephant poaching hadn't been considered a huge threat in Sabah until now. If hunters and traders have chosen to set up shop in the Bornean state, it could be disastrous. Only about 1,500 to 2,000 of the pygmy elephants are alive in the wild today. The WWF estimates there are less than 1,500 of these elephants left in the wild. The World Wildlife Foundation estimates that there are fewer than 1,500 Borneo pygmy elephants left in the wild. 